under government of india so understand the complete admission process right so what they offer is a four years bachelor's program bs or five years bachelor's and master's dual degree programs right and these are very reputed institute with decent uh, placement so only the, the one of the bhopal centers offer uh, you know the you know facilities for uh, only bachelor's program there is no master's program and these are you know best in class infrastructure government facilities that these are government of india institutions and very much recognized in the field of science and technology so you get a very good laboratories and every environment which you need right so these are the institutions so you see seven of them so it's a located in Bahrampur, Bhopal, Kolkata, Mohali, uh, one in Pune and Tiruvanthapuram and Tirupati. So there are only seven institutions or all autonomous institutions recognized by Ministry of Education and uh, these are the seven locations and uh, they provide the best in quality science education which you may be looking and this is about the eligibility so you should be class 12th or equivalent in 2021 or 2022 batch with minimum of 60 percent as an eligible criteria and 55 percent for scst and pwd and the admission is uh, through three examination modes one is they accept the state and central board uh, central board uh, results right and secondly they accept kvpy which is kishore vagyanik protsahan yojana and they also accept je advanced so by je advanced you understand that this is not accepting je means and uh, they are the top class institutions which uh, are looking for the deep you know science students who are very much interested in the r d or research and development and are looking for best in class infrastructure so let's see the dates so the way to apply is online so you have to visit their uh, you know iiser admission.in so that is the website you have to submit your online application at this website iiser admission.in and there is a frequently asked sec questions section where which will help you in filling the form in case you have a doubt so the for this exam the non-refundable fees is 2000 rupees and if you are a student from you know scst kashmiri migrant or pwd then the applicable fees will be a uh, thousand rupees right so let's see the date so the application portal will start on 29th of april and last date for application is 29th of may so one month time is given and the aptitude test is going to happen on the july third right july third and this is applicable for all state board and the central board right so you see the scb on the top of that uh, dates right so it's applicable for state and central boards and you have to enter the ad admission at exam but in case you are you know uh, already entered for kvpy exam or je advance then for you the there will be no exam but admission process uh, you know will be through their respective scorecard so you should have a kvp best scorecard or the je advanced scorecard so for uh, you know for that process september 11 is the date of you know applying through kvpy and the uh, uh, you know final date for uh, last date for submission is september 15 and if you're going through je advanced then the uh, uh, you know starting date to apply is september 11 and last date to apply is 15th so 11 to 15 september you have to fill give your you know application form and fill and submit the result and submit the results which is an uh, you know, output of the je advanced results or the kvpi and you can get admission without iesr exam test right so this is a uh, additional information if you want to contact a college for any reasons you have the email id and the phone number mentioned thank you for watching and please do like and subscribe this channel i'll cover similar exam updates